Hey everybody, it's Hari Swaminathan from OptionTiger.com and just wanted to do a recap for Friday and uh, actually quite a few positions did well, they expired worthless. So let's just go over it. Baba, we converted this into a diagonal and you can see the short is up so we'll just have to make it up that way. We've got enough time on Baba, it's a July uh, 165 call. Baidu is doing well, gained by 400 so we are up 800 on this trade and so this is uh, already a 33% uh, uh, gain over here. Citigroup expired worthless between the two uh, between the two uh, legs of the shorts, and so here we have made uh, uh, on Friday we made 120, and we had already booked about 650, so about 750 or so uh, on Chipotle. Uh, I mean uh, on Citigroup on Chipotle, it is still in the middle of the condor. We don't need to worry. There's 21 days, and so we'll leave it as is. And then Costco went down, but. Costco was the important thing, you know, it, it, it moved up back to 239 as you can see, it went down to, uh, you know, almost 235, but the important thing was to get into Costco as quickly as possible because the volatility would have still been high. So if you go into my filled orders, you'll see that I executed this at 1903, I sold Costco the 242.5, I got 1.99 as the, as the premium and you can see even though it went up, the over the over the course of the morning there was a, the volatility crush happened and you can see it is up so this is why i wanted to get in as quickly as possible and so hopefully everybody has done that microsoft expired worthless we made about 1400 dollars on this and the spy hedge is working very well uh, we are going to keep this obviously because uh, markets are looking very weak at this point and so we'll be keeping these are the two put trades but then we have two uh, two of these microsoft and uh, 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 and Citigroup are both uh, uh, expired, and so we won't have them next week. And so we'll take a we'll take a fresh look at uh, what what opportunities there are next week. My sense is we'll still be looking for put trades, and uh, but we'll uh, we'll review that once we get into the next week. Thank you.